I'm Alan Johnson, KU2Y, and in this video we're going to use these parts to a CubeSat simulator to build a CubeSat, and we're going to follow these instructions here. Okay, so we're going to start with the, uh, with the Pi Zero, which is the single board computer that is at the heart of the CubeSat simulator, and we'll put in the uh, micro SD card that has all the software and the storage. Next, we're going to plug it into the main board. So this is the main board here. You can see it's got the current and voltage sensors. It's got a boost converter, battery charger, uh, some more current and voltage sensors, charging LEDs, push button, and remove before flight. So we're going to plug it into the bottom here. Line it up. There we go. And now we're going to uh, build up the battery board. Now I've already put the, put the three nickel metal hydride batteries uh, in the battery board. So it is ready to go. And, uh, and we will plug it in here. Sometimes there's an extra stacking header here. In this case, there is not. Line that up. Very good. On to page two of the instructions. So now we're working on the uh, STEM payload board. And uh, you see this one actually has a, has a GPS sensor that was mounted on there in the, in the extra area. Um, but we first need to plug in the, uh, the processor and the sensors. In this case, the processor is an STM32. So that goes here. Line up the pins. Put it in, and then we also have the uh, gyro, the the uh, MPU sixty fifty, uh, the IMU, the inertial measurement unit that plugs in right there, and uh, and then finally the pressure, altitude, temperature sensor, the BME two eighty, and we plug that in there. Okay, <clears throat> so now. Let's plug the stem payload board on top. Line it up here. Very good. So, uh, so this completes the three board stack with the uh, Pi Zero on the bottom. So we'll just put that aside. Uh, next, we're going to uh, build the frame. So I've got the frame parts here. This particular one doesn't have a camera. Uh, if it had a camera, we would, we would mount the camera uh, on, on one of the sides. So we need the, uh, the minus X frame and the minus Z frame. And uh, the axes for the CubeSat simulator uh, are shown here in the instructions. So plus Z is up. Uh, plus X is facing outward and plus Y in the other direction there. So uh, I needed the minus X and the minus Z. So those are the two I'm going to do. And I want to snap them together. There we go. Uh, and then next we put the uh, plus X panel here on the other side. There we go. So we've got plus X minus X there. Okay. And now we're going to put the board stack inside the frame and we find the plus X side is the side that's got the push buttons and the charger and the remo remove before flight. And also, if you look, it's a little hard to see, but if you look on the main board, um, it actually labels the uh, actually labels it as uh, as plus X. So I'm going to slide that in here and just uh, just drop it there. So this is the plus X side, and you can see it's got all the switches and LEDs. Okay, so uh, next we're going to start putting the 
uh, solar panels on. So let's have a look at the solar panels. So we've got six solar panels here and they're labeled. And um, we're going to start with the plus X solar panel. So this is it there, labeled plus X. And uh, I'm gonna use the Velcro here. And uh, so I'm just going to put it on here. Actually, I think I did, I did the plus X upside down here. Let me flip this over. There we go. That's better. Now, when I plug this, attach this plus X here, uh, you can see the, you can still get to the, uh, it's a little bit higher, like that. Uh, you can still, still see the uh, switches and LEDs there. Okay, and now we want to do the uh, minus X side here. So this is the minus X panel. If there's a camera here, there'll be two smaller panels. Uh, so I'm just gonna line that up and stick it on. And now we wanna do the, uh, do the minus Y. So that's going to be this side here. Here is our minus Y panel. Yeah. And then we want to do the uh, plus Y panel here. Okay, so we've got all four of those sides. Uh, this one also does not have uh, does not have a, an antenna, so we don't have to deal deal with the coax or or the antenna. Um, but we do need to take the top, which is plus Z, and put the uh, plus Z solar panel on there. So I'm just going to stick it on there. Like this. There we go. That is on there. And then uh, I just put this panel in. There we go. Now all it's left to do is to do, let's straighten these panels up a bit, uh, is put the uh, minus Z panel here on the bottom. Very good. Um, and then the final step is we have our uh, remove before flight switch here. And uh, that plugs into, uh, let's see that there. There is the remove before flight switch. So we just put that in there and insert it. And we are all set. So we have built uh, a CubeSat from the parts here and everything has just clipped together uh, with uh, Velcro or just with, uh, with tension.